So what are we doing now? We're on our way to Lixilla for the Cold Cop 2. Where I'm going to be racing Bosco and Serrano on a short course. Why not Fabi? She's a bit heavy and she's a bit old. And I think that she'll be a good temptation for the boys to run to the finish line. <laughs> yeah. And what are you worried about? Or nervous about? I'm nervous about the boys' start because the last time I raced them, their start wasn't too good and we lost a few seconds on the start. Why? What happened? They got nervous and they didn't know to run. It was their first race, but hopefully today they'll be a lot better. I haven't put the race runners on the sled, which I wish I had of, but it should be okay because I've got new runners on the sled anyway. They're only the training runners. Um, I've took my survival backpack out, so we light about 10 kilos. It should make the sled a bit faster too. What about the other people who are racing? Is there any people that you're worried about? or? Um, in my category, I'm worried about everyone because I think I'm going to be the only one running Siberian Huskies. Everyone else runs dogs like Whippets and Greyhounds and things like that, which I don't think is fair. I think that you should have race categories. One's for like running and hunting dogs and another one for real Siberian Huskies and Malamutes and things like that. the weather conditions today for the race? Weather conditions today are perfect. It was really cold last night which means it's hardened the soft snow that we had last week because we had a bit of a storm. Um, the sun's out today, really nice. Top temperature will be about minus nine. Uh, you're going to have a wind chill of about minus 13 which is good for the boys because they don't like it too hot but they like the sun to be out. Välkommen till knappen. Och snälla kommer på. Jag ska berätta lite grann om vår by. En 90 hushållig knapp. Så tänk att det ska vara stor by. Vi har en skola här. I dagsläget så är det stort sett omöjligt att köpa ett hus i knappen. Det finns ju inte en farlig stigning, en slagmotor på ungefär 3 km. Och då kom ni upp på en vänplan, på en skogsbilväg. Och sen för ni skogsbilvägen, jag tror det 4 km ungefär. Det ni ska tänka på ni som kör 15 att och ni kom upp på det högsta och här börjar du luta väg och hem ganska lång utförsörjning. Längst där ni är en väldigt skarp vänstersväng. So what time are you? What number are you and everything? Number 16. Uh, we're leaving at 11.34. It should be a good race. Sun's out, really nice. What's um, the track like? To go. The track's brilliant. It's going to be great with the new runners on the sled. Do you know where you're going? How do you know where you're going? Um, the signposts for the 11 kilometre race all around. But it's basically just a circle. But there's lots of ups and down bits. Um, there's going to be lots of running. Chewing. Stop chewing. Fanny just chewed herself through the line. And one of the nice people have just come and tied her back up while we was in the toilet. Naughty girl.
Okay. So you have a uh, one minute to talk. About. Okay. Your breath already before you're No, it's the baby. <laughs> I have to look after the baby and the dogs. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Hey, boys! Go. Was it? A lot harder than I thought it would be. But how do you think you've done? Not very well. Not very well. <laughs> <laughs> 